You see, digital payments uh, have come to stay. And in the last uh, few years, I think in the digital uh, payment space, India has made uh, phenomenal progress. During the last uh, finance minister, central governor's uh, G20 meeting at uh, Bangalore, we showcased various aspects of our digital payments, including the UPI, the CBDC, UPI we had also just launched before, you know, a few days before the Bangalore meeting, we had just launched this facility of enabling travelers from foreign countries to also utilize the UPI to make uh, local payments, even though they did not possess, even though they do not, do not have bank accounts in India. The linkage with uh, Singapore Pay Now and uh, RBI's UPI had just been also launched four or five days before the G20 finance ministers and central bank governors meeting that evinced a lot of interest. Now I think there is uh, the phenomenal success of UPI in a large and populous country like you, you, ours has evoked a lot of interest. And I think going forward, uh, already the RBI and the NPCI are in dialogue, in discussion with a number of countries to have uh, similar arrangements as we have with uh, Singapore and to also increase the, enhance the footprint of uh, the uh, UPI. CBDC also, let me mention that uh, uh, the CBDC in the Bangalore meeting was, that is our version of the e-rupee, the central bank digital currency, was seen with a lot of interest. In fact, an eminent uh, person from the international financial uh, sector, he went to the extent of complementing the design of our CBDC and added that the only thing he missed in the CBDC was the smell of a new currency note.